What's up guys? We're going to be doing the first five notes on flute. Um, in the last video, you should have watched uh, how to hold your flute properly. So that's really important that you know where all your fingers go first before we do these five notes. Um, so again, just kind of a review. This, these, this is where your fingers go. Okay, we call this home base. Okay, so from home base, you are going to release fingers two and three on both hands. So from home base, you're gonna release two and three from both hands. Okay, and that's gonna be our first note. This is our B flat. So on the left hand, this hand, you have thumb and one. And on the right hand, you have pinky down still and one. Okay, and you're skipping these two keys because remember each key is assigned a finger and if the finger is not touching that key then it doesn't need to be pushed down so this is our b flat so let's see what our b flat will sound like so that's our b flat sound i'm going to play four quarter note b flats so i'm tonguing the note again so i'm kick starting each sound with the t sound. So we're going to say So try the B flat with me. So again, thumb in one, pinky and one. Make sure those other keys are being left alone. So one more time, play with me. One, two, ready, go. And that's our B flat. Okay, so from here, we're gonna go to C. We're going to take that finger off, but that's the first finger. We're gonna take that off. We're gonna keep this pinky on. And here's the hard part. We we have to take the thumb from our left hand off. So you have your first finger on the left hand and your pinky. That's it. First finger and pinky. You're probably wondering how my flute hasn't hit the floor yet. Well, remember the balance points I talked about in holding your flute properly? Here's your balance point, and here is your other balance point. The thumb of your right hand, and that little hook, that right, um, the left hand, left finger, the first finger, the hook right there, that's your other balance point. Okay, so the C is really important that you do not have your thumb touching the flute at all for C. So you can't cheat and put your thumb back here and hold up the flute. That's a no-no. Okay, we wanna make sure the thumb is just hovering over this key, even though we're not using it for C. It's important that it stays close because once we learn to change fingers, um, it's important to have all of the fingers close to the assigned key. Okay, so here's my C. Okay, and it's easier when you're playing because you can push the flute up against your face to help hold it up. That's our C. I'm going to play C four quarter notes. Try it with me. One, two, three, four. That's our C. So now we're going to go to D. D is the opposite of C. So this is what I tell my students. Everything that's up right now, so all these fingers, they come down. And everything that was down, which is just this one and this one, those two fingers come up. So they switch places. I'll do that again. So here was a C. All the fingers that were down go up. All the fingers that were up go down, so they switch places on their designated keys. Okay, so now if you did that right, your first finger should be up, that one is not being pushed down, and the pinky is also up, that one is not being pushed down. But the thumb is back on now, because it was up for C, and everything else here is also down. This is our D, listen. I'll play D four times, four quarter notes. Play with me. One, 
two, three, four. That's our D. Next one is E flat. This one's really easy. Okay, watch the pinky. That's it. Okay, so the pinky comes down, that's our E flat. So D to E flat is our easiest switch. Okay, so just pinky down and you'll get this E flat sound. So I'll play E flat four quarter notes. Play with me. One, two, three, four. That's our E flat. Next one is our F. Okay, so F, we're gonna have all of our fingers down with our left hand, and we're gonna take the two fingers, fingers two and three, and take that off. So F is everything down with the left hand, pinky, and one. And these two fingers are off. Here's our F. I'll play F four times, quarter notes. Play with me, one, two, three, four. And that's our F. So that was uh, five notes, B flat, C, it's the hard one, D, E flat, it's the easy one, and F. Okay, so finger changing on flutes as a beginner is probably the toughest out of all of the instruments. So you guys might find that uh, you're behind the other sections when it comes to changing notes and changing fingers. And that's okay because you have it. Look at all these keys that you have to push down and they're all different. Okay, so take your time doing that. However, practice makes perfect. You should be changing fingers constantly. Have somebody quiz you. Um, over the five notes, see if you can remember how to finger it. That's probably more important than getting a sound out on your flute um, during these lessons. So if somebody says B flat, B flat, C, D, E flat, F, and then jumble it up, D, C, F, E flat. Okay, make it into a game, it'll be fun. Okay, so again, the notes are B flat, C, D, E flat, F. Okay, and that's obviously the goal to be able to switch from note to note with ease. And that's it, those are the five notes on the flute for beginning band.